Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So Summer of Pain week three is just about to be over. Uh, I went ahead and did this Summer of Pain challenge before Diablo is getting his buff. Uh, I don't know whether Diablo would end up being the best counter, but uh, from all the videos that I saw, Immortal Abomination is the champion to use. Now, there are other options, uh, plenty of videos now with people getting a one shot, but I'm doing something a little bit different. So if you saw in the beginning, I have several of the level one revives expiring. They're just gonna expire. So I'm not trying to get a one shot. I just wanna get a good shot and then I can use one of those expiring uh, revives and then be done with this challenge. So if I can do this challenge in one revive, we're good. Uh, as you can see there, I'm boosting up because I don't like long fights. Now, I am unfamiliar with Immortal Abomination, all right? Uh, so this is the first fight of this type that I'm using uh, him in. Now, you saw the nose that we have to deal with. This fight is very, very annoying. Uh, a lot of people felt that it was too hard, um, and it is pretty difficult. Uh, I'm not a fan of long fights in the best of times, okay? Uh, so chances are I'm not going to enjoy a long fight. But the thing that made this fight a little bit more annoying is the RNG nature of it. Uh, Mysterio has a very weird AI, and his AI loves to fire off heavy attacks. We don't know why. He'll just spam them. And in this fight, if you're using Immortal Abomination, you need him to fire his specials off. Okay? You also have to worry after the special one. And just look at this. I just ate all of that. But I'm still trying to get used to it. So I'm showing you guys my entire experience with this fight. Instead of just uploading a one shot, which you can find all over the place, I want to show you my process and just how I did this fight. Okay. So the first fight ate a good five piece combo. Okay. And the biscuits. Uh, and we just go right back in. Now, a couple of things that I noticed, and I also saw uh, some other YouTubers. Uh, shout out to Captain Bay. Uh, he also mentioned this, but. You know how you normally avoid hitting into Mysterio right after he does a special one because you don't want to get all that damage back? Well, because of the node, he's going to be taking reduced damage. I mean, a lot of, what is it, like 90% or something like that, reduced damage unless his helmet is cracked and he's got a poison. So in the beginning, early on, before you, you know, put any poisons, crack his helmet, anything like that, uh, you can go ahead and hit into him after a special one to get some distance because you don't want to get trapped in the corner. But more often than not, you're going to end up getting trapped in the corner because that is the RNG nature. And you see here, I got smacked up a little bit and I'm in the corner trying to get him to fire his special one off. You know, and I want to do uh, a special three first, then get a special two, and then spam the special ones until the aura goes away and then I repeat the process. But look, I'm just trying to get him to fire his special. Okay, finally he fired his special one. Okay, and I'm in the corner. I don't want to fire the special three off right now, um, but we're just waiting, waiting. Okay, boom, now we're good. And I'm firing off my special three. All right, so we haven't lost that much health. I am running suicides as you saw, uh, and I did boost up. We haven't done any damage to him, really. All right, this is all the setup. All right, now his helmet is cracked. He's got a heal block on, all right? And we need to start putting some poisons on him. Uh, and you can see he's getting hurt a little bit. We're not doing the big boy damage yet. Okay, right now I'm trying to build up to a special two, all right? And that matador means that you're not going to gain any power unless he fires his specials. And look at this. 
I'm in the corner, boom, just getting smacked up. All right, finally, I fire off my special two, but at this point, I already know that this attempt is a wrap. Okay, there's no way. All right, look at this. I'm just, I'm just eating it. I'm just like, okay, whatever. All right, once I got hurt like that, I already knew that I just needed to reset. Okay, um, and again, just trying to get a good run. I don't want to, like that attempt right there, there's no way. I'm just going to keep going until I can get a good run. If I can get a one shot, beautiful. But I'm not really trying to get a one shot. I just want to get this thing done using the least amount of resources. All right. So we're basically doing that um, strategy. Uh, there's also other strategies. I've seen people spamming special twos and ones. Uh, but... I thought that this one was a pretty decent one. Uh, the drawback is that you have a lot of setup. You got to get to that special three. So you have to bait out three of his special ones or just three of his specials. You don't really want to deal with his special two because it does a power drain. Okay. So it's got to be a special one. So right here. All right. We're back in the corner again. I'm waiting out that special one. All right. The nice thing about uh, Immortal Abomination is that when he hits into my block, it's putting that weakness on it. So that kind of reduces the uh, damage. All right, so we got to a special three, fired it off. Now the game plan is to bait out special, um, uh, special so that I can get to my special two. Okay, so here we go, bait out another one. We don't wanna bait out a special two. Uh, we want to just keep baiting out special ones. And see, I wanted to be careful there. There's a, a lot to, keep track of and a lot of times i was getting hit because i was too busy watching to see okay wait is his special one or over is the damage reflect phase done and so i'm like looking up here looking up here not watching him and he'll do a quick heavy in a minute okay so we managed to get the special two and our health is pretty decent at this point okay so you can see that he's starting to do some good damage all right we still want to bait out special ones and at this point we want to spam our special ones, okay? Until that aura that you see up there, the little green all the way to the left buff up there, until that goes away, okay? So here, I'm just waiting that, that phase out. Okay, now I can finally fire my special one, okay? Now you see the aura that I just mentioned, you see it's like half right now, okay? And look at the damage. Now we're doing some damage. So it's a slow play, but the damage is there. And so this is the first time I'm actually finally getting some good damage on him, but that's not enough damage for me to, you know, stop and say, okay, I'll revive. So I'm still going, I'm still trying to do as best I can. All right, the aura is gone at this point. So now I need to repeat what I did before. Now, some people will do it a little bit differently. I don't know what the best way to do it is. Okay, just look at these heavies. And then I remembered, hey, he doesn't have a, um, uh, um, his helmet isn't cracked and he's not, um, and just look at, I just got eight up. And so at this point I knew that this one was a wrap. Okay, so I got trapped in the corner and that was it, okay? Uh, sometimes he doesn't throw his special. So that's that was my main gripe, you know, while I don't like long fights, this fight had a lot of RNG because you need to be able to, um, he needs to be able to, to fire his specials off. You gotta uh, basically have him work with you, okay? And if he doesn't work with you, then that's it. You know, there's not a whole lot you can do. So, we're doing another attempt, but you basically uh, have the strategy down now. Okay, that is the strategy uh, that I'm following. Uh, we're trying to get to a special three. So we need him to, you know, fire his specials off. And uh, it's always, always happens, always happens, always happens. Um, but we're trying to get his uh, specials out of him. Then we fire off the special three. Then we fire off a special two. And then 
we just spam special ones until the aura is done, wash, rinse, and repeat. It shouldn't take that many um, iterations of that. Okay, it shouldn't take that many. Um, but this is, I, I don't even know what attempt number this is, but I'm just going, trying to do uh, as much damage uh, as I can, right? So here, I don't want to bait that special three. I don't, I mean, uh, his special two. I don't want him to get to a special two. And just look at this. He will not. He just, okay, finally, he did. I'm just like, wow. And that is what I don't like. I don't like the fact that I have to wait that out. Okay, now, at this point, I can hit him, as you see here, uh, even before the phase is up. But we've got to bait that out. And look at that. He's just doing like some double heavies uh, or, or you know, look at this. And then I'm just like, really? What, who, who did the AI of this, you know? And at this point, I just was panicked. I was in the corner. I fired off a special two, which I shouldn't, or a special one, which I shouldn't have done while he still had that um, phase up. So you saw that I was missing. And I'm just like, this fight is not fun. It's not fun at all. Um, I've heard people doing this fight with, um, uh, I think, Archangel. I think they did it uh, with Archangel. The other thing that I didn't mention is that uh, normally you would have a very small pool of champions that you could use. Uh, because Mysterio, you'd want to break his helmet. And, you know, they have that node where unless you've got a poison on him or something like that. He takes uh, much less damage. Uh, so, but because every special puts a heal block and a armor break on him, you don't have to look for a heal block champion that does armor break. You just really need somebody that does poison damage. And you can do this. It may take a while, but you can do it. And this, I'm just getting practice in because my health is so low, I already know that I'm not going to get it done. And I got hit again with the heavy. I hate fighting Mysterio. Those heavy attacks come out of nowhere. And a lot of times, you see, I just got frustrated and was like, you know what, there's no point in continuing uh, that fight. All right. And so I'm just like, all right, let's do this again. Okay. Okay. And I just did. I love that feature, by the way, where you can just hit restart. Uh, one of the times I ended up going out by mistake and uh, didn't uh, 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 hit the restart. OK, um, but in any case, that was me, by the way, um, phone call. And then I got an email notification that I had a voicemail, um, but it wasn't you. All right. So here we go again. Still trying to do it. All right, he's firing his specials. All right, everything's looking good. I'm hitting him so I don't go into the corner. All right, he fired his special. Right now, this is perfect. Okay, at this point, it is perfect. I'm just waiting out the uh, phase, and now I'm firing my special three. So if I can play this perfectly from this point on, and he fires his specials off regularly, we can get him down but we need both of those things. I need to play well, and I need him to also fire his specials. Okay, so here we go, firing the special off. Good, we love it. Uh, I'm, I wanna bait out another one. All right, and then just boom. Five piece to the face. So this run is a wrap. We're done. We haven't even gotten to our next one. So you see, I was just like, you know what? No point in continuing. I know what I need to do in this fight now, so I have a very good idea of what I need to do and when I need to quit. All right, and you see there, I, I misclicked, and instead of hitting the restart, I just went all the way out. Didn't mean to do that, uh, but that's how frustrated I was getting, just starting to get really frustrated, all right? And a lot of times I'm getting hit like that because I keep looking away looking up to see his buffs, to see what phase he's in, uh, to make sure I'm not hitting him when he has, you know, an armor breakup or poison up or something like that, because I don't want to take all that damage back. All right, so here we go again. We're trying it 
once more. All right, he's firing his specials off. So far, so good. In the beginning, like I said, you can hit him like this to get some distance so you're not uh, blocked into the corner. Also, you can hit into his block if he ever blocks, all right? Again, waiting it out, fire my special three. After this, we got to get him to fire more specials so we can get to our special two. Then we got to get him to fire more specials so we can spam our special one as much as we can. Okay, so here he is going to be taking a little damage, but it's not the big boy damage. All right, so once again, now we need to hit him. Um, all right, there we go. Uh, we were waiting out that phase. All right, and we need to get him to a special two. All right, here we go. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. And woo. All right. Now, at this point, I'm not really sure where I'm at in my strategy. All right. I knew I had to fire the special two off. Uh, so we're good. And you can see the damage. We're baiting out. Okay, the special one. Now, at this point, we can't hit him. All right. We'll take a lot of damage back. So we're in the corner. And then I hit him by mistake because I got nervous. Now we're firing the special one off. And the damage is coming. And because I run suicides, I am taking, you know, some recoil. All right. So here we go. All right. And we got to wait it out. All right. Wait it out. Wait it out. All right. Now we can fire off our special one. And just look at the damage. Look at the damage that's being done. Okay. The damage is now starting to ramp up. Okay. There we go. He baited out another um, special. And now we just have to wait that out again. All right. And then hit a little bit. Fire off that special one. Now he's close to a special two, and sometimes they're reluctant to fire their specials when that's the case. But we're going to try to bait this out. Okay. He's not one to fire it. Not one to fire it. But look at his health. He's, he's hurt. Okay. He is hurt, but we're still trying to bait it out. Finally. He went and fired his special one. All right, so now we need to wait again. Okay, just wait, parry, do whatever. Don't get trapped in the corner. All right, and here we go. We're doing the same thing again. And boom, more good damage, okay? So that's pretty much how you have to do the fight. All right, but it's reliant on him firing his specials. And look at him. He's not firing his special, but he's taking a lot of damage, okay? And let's look at this. Now we're in the corner. And I'm just like, really? Come on, fire your special. No, he's not firing his special. There we go. Now he's going doing the heavy attacks. Come on, fire your special. All right, he's backing away. F come on, fire it. No, nope, no firing. Come on, fire your special. All right, so now my aura is gone. Okay, by this time it's gone. And he's still not firing his special. Finally, he fires off a special. All right, so now at this point, I'm like, okay, you know what? I may need to just go ahead and uh, fire something off here. All right. Um, but we're going to try it. We're going to try it again. Okay. He's not playing nice right here. Okay. Um, we got some distance. Okay. Push him back a little bit because we were in that corner. Woo. That was a very advanced baiting technique. Yeah, I got lucky. All right. Look out. Fast reflexes. All right. And then look at this. Full five-piece combo. So at this point, I know it's a wrap. Okay? I did some good damage. He's almost gone. And I'm just like, wow. He wouldn't fire his special. Finally fires his special. And I'm like, what am I supposed to do at this point? You know? Um, so I'm just like, all right, let's just try and see as much damage as we can do. Okay? Fire off that special one, even though I'm going to take recoil damage. Uh, and just see how much we can do before we go down. There's there's not much else I can do, okay? And then I get caught by the special one that I've been evading all this time, okay? Whatever. So at this point, I'm thinking about those revives in my overflow that are about to expire. And I'm like, yeah, no. Not going to do that entire fight from the beginning again trying to get a one shot, uh, load up, help heal up a little bit, uh, just to give me a little bit of a breathing room. And then I got to hope now that he will 
do what I need him to do, meaning fire his specials off. All right. So we just have a little bit of health left on him. If he plays well with it, we can get by with just one revive. But if he doesn't, we're going to end up using more than one revive because I got them expiring and uh, I'm not doing this fight over again until I get him done. Okay, so if it takes two, three revives, we're doing it. Don't feel bad. That's what they're there for. Use them up. All right, so now we're, we're good. He fired his specials off. We're in the corner. All right, that's fine. Phase is over. Hit that special three. And we should start seeing some uh, results. As long as we can do this and he fires his specials, we should be okay. Okay, so this time I just want to parry. All right, there we go. Um, all right, come on. Get him to bait, you know, fire another special. And here I was, I'm nervous. Because I'm like, if he doesn't fire his specials off, I'm, I'm really in a bind. All right? So there it is. He don't want to fire his special off. But we are doing a little bit of damage to him. So that's fine. Okay? And so here we go again. In the corner. You're going to spend time in the corner. Just, just know that. Okay, and uh, at this point, I'm trying to get that special two off. And you see, I'm hitting into his block, push him away. Okay, and it also angers them so that they fire their specials off a little bit more. That's at least what I've noticed. Nothing said in the game about that. All right, so now we're going to hit him with that special two. Cracked it. He's got some um, uh, health block, armor break. Now we need to bait this out. All right. And uh, as long as we can uh, wait out that phase, don't get hit and beat up too much. There we go. Now we fire the special one off and we're looking good. At this point, I'm pretty confident that I'm going to be able to take him down uh, with only one revive. Okay, so here we go. We're at the end and he is finally down. So that is going to do it, guys. After this, I needed a nap. Let me tell you. But that's going to do it. Thank you all for watching. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video and your experiences fighting this Mysterio. And you all have a blessed day.